on the fence, the gates open. Oi! Fucking idiots, they're bashing him up. They're bashing him up. I really appreciate you joining me today and this story comes from London in Abbey Wood and thank you to everybody that has responded and reacted and helped this video go viral because I was trying to find out who was involved in order to be able to find out details of the case. It has now been revealed the video took place in Abbey Wood and it involved a 16 year old that had been arrested on suspicion of a robbery and police had used excessive force some people have said to be able to ensure this arrest. This happened on Friday the 10th of June and the video shows the boy being punched repeatedly by the police after he's held on the ground and the Metropolitan Police have said that the incident is being investigated. The Met Police said that they will be assessed and everybody involved will have to show why they did it and what happened and body cam footage will also be looked at. This has been referred to the Directorate of Professional Standards and an investigation is underway. Police were called after allegations of a robbery of a teenager by a group of males who threatened him with a bottle. Inquiries led them to an address and they found the property that was reported as stolen. A Metropolitan Police officer said that a 16 year old was sought from the address and was detained by police on suspicion of the robbery and he was bailed pending further inquiries. They said that another male entered the premises and during the course of the incident he assaulted police. The 16 year old was arrested on suspicion of common assault of an emergency worker and he has been released under investigation. So this story has definitely escalated and it also raises a lot of questions and I would really like to speak to the relatives, the mother or father of the 16 year old that is involved to try to get their side of what has happened because the police have spoken out but this child hasn't had his say. And with the fact that they never charged him with any offence and he was released under investigation is also questionable as well because if somebody assaulted an emergency worker and that the emergency worker wrote a statement about it, they would be charged straight away. But I really want to hear what you think on the force that was used and whether it was appropriate. And thank you for everybody that has supported the channel. And please don't forget to send your stories to news at scarcitystudios.com. And follow at Scar City Studios on Instagram, TikTok, Twitter and Facebook. And I'll be back again very shortly with some more news. Peace.